Title, McKinsey & Co. here, the unlikely duo spicing up biz with AL Word Magic. T-L-D-R, buckle up, yo. We're in for an AI joyride. McKinsey, the consulting powerhouse, and Co. here, AR Wizards, are joining forces. What's the aim? To sprinkle a little AI fairy dust over their clients' businesses and transform the mundane to the insane. They're planning to use generative AI, think smart machines spinning word webs like Shakespeare, for personalized business solutions. The cool part? They're focusing on data protection while doing so. But here's the question, can AI really conjure up the future of business, or are we heading for a tech-induced haze? It's a super cool time in the business world, friends. Today, we're looking at a combo that's got us hyped. It's like peanut butter and jelly, or Batman and Robin. We're talking about McKinsey, the consulting powerhouse you've heard your business major friends dream about, and Cohere, a leading developer of AI platforms. These two are stepping out in style, planning to use the power of generative AI, read, smart machines creating and using human language, to transform client businesses into something straight out of a sci-fi flick. What's more, the alliance will be spearheaded by Quantum Black, McKinsey's AI arm, and a team that sounds like it belongs in the Avengers. Data engineers, data scientists, product managers, designers, software engineers, they've got them all. But can businesses just plug and play generative AI? Is it as easy as uploading a funny cat video to YouTube? Well, not quite. According to Ben Ellenweig, a McKinsey senior partner, every client context, use case, an organization is unique, which means they're aiming to provide tailored solutions that account for privacy, IP protection, and cost. That's a lot of boxes to check, but hey, with great power comes great responsibility, right? But wait, let's take a step back. Who is Cohere, and why does this matter? With HQs in San Francisco and Toronto, and a key research center in London, Cohere seems like a significant player in the AI game. Their team includes experts in AI, machine learning, and software engineering. The CEO is Aidan Gomez, a Google Brain alum, which tells us they're not just messing around. They're on a mission, they say, to transform enterprises with AI and offer a more intuitive way to generate, search, and summarize information. A noble cause indeed, but do we risk losing the human touch in the process? In addition to this, Cohere places a significant emphasis on data protection, they deploy models inside enterprises' secure data environments, and they're independent and cloud agnostic. No strings attached, it seems. But in a world where data is as valuable as gold, can they maintain this stance? We are not beholden to any one tech company and empower enterprises to implement customized AI solutions on the cloud of their choosing, or even on-premises, says Martin Kahn, CEO and president of Cohere. Data privacy, data security, and customization are critical to creating strategic differentiation and real business value. So, they're aiming to put businesses in the driving seat of their AI journey. From defining generative AI use cases to designing IT architectures, they plan on offering end-to-end -end support. But could this be a case of too many cooks spoiling the broth? Or is it just the right mix of ingredients for a successful AI recipe? Apparently, some companies are already reaping the benefits of this collaboration. For instance, a financial services group is using generative AI to manage routine customer feedback in over 100 languages, slashing wait times. The big question remains, will this collaboration herald a new era of business operation or will it end up as another complex piece of tech jargon we'll struggle to comprehend? Will generative AI transform businesses in the way McKinsey and Cohere envision, or are we biting off more than we can chew? Let's hear your thoughts.